why DTC is the next step for consumer goods brands. I think it comes down to merchandising because you've got the big problem, first of all, of product discovery, right? And if you manage to do that, so let's say you get your, your granola bars into Kroger. Well, you probably had to really work that sale to get in there and you have just a short period of time where your goods are actually getting shelf space and you've got to wow the people at Kroger, like the buyers there, and have some tremendously good sales to keep your shelf space there. Otherwise, they're gonna rotate you out for some other granola brand company. And that's just how it works because physical stores have limited shelf space. Let's say that you converted over your, a certain number of customers because they saw you in Kroger, because they saw your ad on Facebook, and they're like, Kroger doesn't carry my favorite granola bars anymore. What do I do? Now you've got an entire generation of people who think nothing of going online and ordering directly from the retailer, the manufacturer, the brand, they'll Google it. Where can I buy this granola bar? And when they find some place that doesn't look sketchy and will ship it to them on auto ship, they're so happy. So make sure that's what you're doing. <laughs>